Yeah, look at that. Literally sure. nothing has changed. Hey, I'm wearing the same glasses. <laughs> you remember. Her same exact hairdo, same glasses. <laughs> I love that you found your style so early and you're Thank like, this you. is work and I'm gonna keep rocking I'm with like, it. This is who I am. <laughs> you know, the movie is really funny and it's like, you know, you get older. I think like when I was a teenager, I was sort of a little bit more uh, belligerent. Mostly now when I look at the poster, I'm just perplexed that there's so many white people on a poster. It just feels really, I'm like, oh, so this was 2001? All right, well, good job, guys. Um, These Brazilian kids are crazy for this word Velcro. Do you know what this is? What? I know what Velcro is. Yeah, I think it's like, imagine Velcro, but sexual? What? Do you know what I mean? This is a uh, thing in Brazil? Now, how does really? Velcro become sexual? I don't know, but anyway, the kids love Velcro. They're constantly sending me messages like, do you want a Velcro? You want a Velcro? And they're like, all those laughing face emojis. Like, this right, is the right, funniest right. thing. Does anyway, anybody know how Velcro have, is a I sexual term? I have an idea, term? but I don't, I don't think I can Well, say. the only thing I can picture is the way you separate Velcro and it kind of sticks but like with your privates, <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah, I feel like, job. I feel like I'm, that's something I'm feeling like I'm talking to a sailor. <laughs> <laughs> they stick, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Listen, oh my. I just had my 75th birthday last week. <laughs> <laughs> what do I care, you know? Bully. No, but I was bullied for being weird. And, really? Uh, but, Me too. Really? Yeah. Where'd well, you go to school? You look at us. Yeah. I went to a <laughs> ghetto school. Yeah, they all hated me. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. No, that's tricky because it's, it's always a it, good thing in the end, isn't it? Yeah, it is. It's like a horror when you're going through it, and then nothing could be better for being a grown up. I don't remember my you first. You don't remember your first kiss. kiss. Gosh, I mean, I can hardly remember the first guy I slept with. <laughs> <laughs> What's up? Is this something that yeah. comes from your daily life? Yeah. This obsession with death? Yes, yes. Uh, thank you. Uh, and, Do you uh, think about death a lot? I, I mean, constantly, and don't we all? I mean, it's really... Uh I don't it's, think I do, actually. Really? I no, think it's, I really don't think I do think about it all. Yeah, no. because, you know, you're tall. So, but for us, <laughs> uh, down here, uh, the experience is, you know, we're so low to the ground already, and yeah, that's yeah. how cemeteries work, obviously, <laughs> and so back, though, et cetera. Uh, so... This is one of the most gorgeous photos I have ever seen on the Internet. Uh, I mean, and I look at a lot of things I, this is so good. I'm like, is it Claudia Schiffer? I don't know what's happening. It's, is it Kate Moss? Is it Naomi Campbell? I, I, there's no way of knowing. What a great, great beauty. And what an outfit this is. It says right here, supermodel. And there's so many emojis to describe the feelings. And this is root beer. And I mean, here she's wearing a little bandana, one of the great outfits. It says here, Netflix and root beer. It could be Netflix and chill. Instead, it says Netflix. And this is such a gorgeous photo. It's a crime that it's not on the cover of Elle magazine every single month in every single country. Something to think about. You know, we're having a great time. We're there for the Pride Parade. Great. And there's other uh, characters there from uh, Sense8, now defunct. Okay. Uh, Sense8, great show. Daredevil, the blind right. show. Yeah. Uh, and the blind a, show. Yeah, he's, that's the main thing yeah, about that show. Yeah. The blind show. You no, know, he has no superpowers. He's just, <laughs> he's, he's sight impaired. Yeah, it's a whole show about a guy. Anyway, uh -huh. yeah, one thing leads to another. And uh, how about we get to know each other? You what, know what, what I mean? What are you talking about? Like uh, a Netflix mixer orgy was the suggestion. Wait, who suggested you guys have an orgy? I don't recall, okay? <laughs> Jeff Sessions. But the, I, 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 I don't, but the, I don't but recall. But the idea was that, okay, you're there at a Netflix mixer in Brazil, and someone says, hey, we're all in right. the same, yeah. affiliated with the same company. We could get it on together. Right. <laughs> you know, Netflix... Dump all the cast together and make a gumbo, right? Yeah. <laughs> It's like the wild, wild west of television. Do you know yes, what I mean? Yes, Netflix. Sound I want to ask you about the cheerleader because you were a little, a little wild in American Pie, but this mm -hmm. is now you're playing a wholesome cheerleader. Wholesome. Are you? Wholesome. Are you? I don't know. Wholesome. Sure, I'm wholesome. I can cook. <laughs> I typically go to bed around here, like two, two to three in there, and it's not good. Cause then sometimes I got big fights. Becca was standing behind you. Cause Becca's like, guess what? We're waking up at six. Let's go on the view today. I'm like, at the time when it was over here, this was the day before I said, no problem. All of a sudden now it's 3 a.m. 
uh, Big Trouble Little China. You know what I mean? I can't make it at 6 a.m. So that's when I start sending emails is between 2 and 3, and I start saying, hey, listen, this was a bad idea. <laughs> I wrote a check my ass, just can't cash tomorrow. So sorry. Call Barbara Walters and tell her ixnay on the view, eh? And then somehow, ding, 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 6 a.m., we're up and at them. It just happens. It's another day. Hi, I'm Natasha Leone, and I'm a New Yorker. <laughs> I can't say that. Hi, I'm Natasha. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, I'm Natasha Leone, and I'm a New Yorker. You're mouthing the words! <laughs> I really enjoy using the word touche mm -hmm. uh, inappropriately. Yeah, I feel like it gets a great <laughs> response. People always use it like it's such a heady term, but if you just throw it around like, what are you doing for breakfast? And you're like, touche. <laughs> That's it, the relationship's over. Touche. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, What is your favorite song lyric? You better run, 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 run. Touche. Touche. Huh? Okay. Oh, this one's a little, um... Her microphone doesn't work. <laughs> and her chair is busted. <laughs> but he, you know, had the earpiece in, which is like a real thing, I guess, Brando did. And uh, so he would just like, I think I, because I was in the makeup under the bed, I don't think, because I remember Brando and James Woods, neither person really treated me like I was actually a person in there. I think it was just because the prosthetic makeup was so heavy. And they certainly didn't treat me like I was like a 17-year-old girl or something. <clears throat> and uh, anyway, the story goes on, the story goes on. Uh, um, uh, Brando would just be like listening for his line to be fed to him from uh, off camera of like, uh, you know, like, uh, the power of Christ compels you. The power of Christ. What? <laughs> the power of Christ compels you. You know, and uh, while he was doing that, the whole time he was, I think, meant to be in the stage direction, like, he's feeling me up. He's like a pervy priest, because it's a spoof movie. Uh, so, but he just kept on like that for, like, you know, the whole day, really. Because, like, <laughs> Okay, so he was just all day, like, right? oh, holding on to my tip, being like, just all day, and I didn't know, like, and I, you know, because I didn't pass that time where I should have initially said, you know, you can remove your hand between takes. And then it was like, if I did bring it up, it would it be so awkward for him, maybe, that, like, you know, it had been going on for hours, and frankly, I was just, No, because I was what 18. Um, those are prosthetics. I still haven't gotten the boob job. Um, those aren't your real boobs. <laughs> no, I'm just curious. Shall we exchange the rings? We shall. Aha. All right. Alex, will you please uh, place this finger? <laughs> Look, there's no naps during the wedding. So let's just, we'll just start that again, yep. right? Here we go. Okay. No napping. No napping. It's not a big quite, You and, and Fred Armisen are, are, are an item. Yeah. So you had to call Fred Armisen. Yes. And was he pro-orgy or, or against orgy? No, this is an A1 winner boyfriend. You know what I mean? Uh, this is a really top-notch guy. I, I love you. You know, you will do what you need to do. You know what I mean? <laughs> And do what you need to do. <laughs> He's like, you know, you want to make friends with the new members of... <laughs> what? Sure, sure. Person, I know you guys are close friends. Yeah. She did an impersonation of you, which was good. Yeah. You can, what, can you want to see it? I would love to. Okay, can love you throw that up for her, please? Where is it? Just look for a screen. No, actually, I made out with Natasha Leone in a movie. Oh, you did? I love Natasha. Me too. Yeah, she's fun. Yeah, I know. She called me up for that movie and was just like, hey, Aubrey, you want to make out with me in this movie, just show up for a couple days. And I was like, yeah. 
So that happens. Addicted to Fresno. Check it out. It came out seven years ago. <laughs> yeah. You know, it's, uh, it's funny uh, seeing her do that because, um, you know, she seems like sort of uh, effusive and into me. And yet, I remember at the time when I was fingering her, she was very much like, oh, my God, that feels great. I just came so hard. So it's just interesting to see that. I right here all the time talking to all kinds of people. <laughs> You're one of the most unusual, in, 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 in a delightful way, Thank people you, to talk Conan. to. You are such an interesting person to talk Thank to. Thank you. It's so uh, nice to come here. The things that you've said already <laughs> just tonight, you've said 15 things that make absolutely no sense Thank to me. Thank you. <laughs> My job here is done. But they're delightful. Yeah. They're delightful. Thank you. We overfed some sheep. I wasn't born yet. This is just, you know, this is just what my parents told me. Your memory tests get sketchy when you haven't been born yeah. yet. Yeah. yeah, I also think I'm developing premature arthritis, actually. Why? I don't know. It just feels funny. Whenever I wake up on an airplane, my hands are really numb. But that's besides the point. I have a okay, joke you for know, you. Okay, you know, it is. I have a joke for you. It is besides the point. Okay. Um, okay, so look. Okay. Okay, so look. There's three ladies in my hand, Jay. There are three ladies in your hand. Yes, okay. there are. She's blonde, mm -hmm. she's a brunette, and she's a redhead. Mm -hmm. Okay, now I want you to pick up the blonde. Uh, okay. All right, put her by the side of your face. All right. Does that feel like the first time you made love? Uh, no. Okay, put her back, put her back. Uh, okay. Pick up the brunette. Uh, all right. Put her there. Does that feel like the first time you did it? Uh, uh, no, no. Put her back, uh, too. Okay. Put her... Ooh, now pick up the redhead. Uh -huh. Redhead. She's a redhead. She's hot. All right. Put Does her right. it do it for you? No. no, not like the first time you had sex. Put no. her back. Okay. Okay, now pick them all up. Shake them up. Does that feel... Oh. <laughs> and you fell for it. Uh, the heat is disgusting. You know? What you mean? Where? In in the rest of the world? Yeah, just in general, like right. in the world. You don't like heat. I don't like heat. I don't like shorts. Um, I don't like uh, the filth and the muck that comes with it. Um, you know, I'm because I live in New York. Yeah. Um, oh, you don't like when in New York in the summer it gets very hot, and you don't like people wearing shorts? I, I think it's disgusting. Um, I mean, I understand the necessity, um, right. but it makes me very uncomfortable. Like if you're, uh, yeah, you live in New York, I feel like it's um, sort of like unintentional street smarts that you know you just uh, come up with, like as uh, you grow up in the city. So when I see somebody, let's say, in there, like a man and they're in flip-flops, and they're on the subway. Nothing makes me sicker, you know? Really? Yeah. You hate just looking at that guy's foot. Yeah, I mean, I think it's disgusting. I think in general, it's like a full-blown turn-off. Yeah. Uh, you know, a straight man in a flip-flop. I, I don't care what you're... As far as I'm concerned, there's no excuse. There's yeah. no justification <laughs> for it. Right. So it's what you're nauseating. basically saying is you would buy a summer home in Iceland because you know that it's so cold <laughs> yes. that, that this no is one's going to be... Saying. Yes. You'd go to that length not to see a man's bare foot <laughs> yes. in a flip-flop. Yes, that is exactly what I'm saying. That's... Yes. Wow, you really despise it. You despise <laughs> <Yes>. bare flesh. <laughs> yes, I do. Check this out. <laughs> Finally, you're an actress. Show us, I uh, love this word, bemused. A lot of us don't know what it means, bemused. Bemuse, verb, to cause to be bewildered, confused. <laughs> yes, I am! Such a joy meeting you. Did you have fun? Yeah, I, I had a nice time, thanks. Your character is also a, a crackhead, too, right? No, I think... No, that's me. Um, oh, that's you? Character. Oh, I'm sorry, I got your no, real no, no, life no, no, confused no. with her. My, my character <laughs> is... Um, my character was just a junkie. A I junkie. Know. I mean, okay. I'm sure she tried crack. What junkie, junkie doesn't try crack? But okay. I don't know that a lot of junkies are crackheads. Okay. You ever I think a lot of junkies are actually really uptight about it. They're like, you know, don't, you know, I would never do crack. I would just do heroin. Just not do that heroin. I know. I'm okay, just well, saying this is my, not that I would ever know. You, you, not you, that I would, I've ever hung out with <laughs> <people> like that <laughs> or anything. But I'm just saying. Wait, that would turn be the my music guess. down. I want Natasha to get this out straight. Yeah. What? Okay, so you never done crack. Listen, I am not ashamed of my past and no. it is public record. No, uh, you know yeah, what I mean? Yeah, yeah, but you never done crack. 
Oh, I mean, I never said that. You know what I mean? <laughs> now you're just putting words in my mouth. I don't know why you're getting so uptight about it anyway. I mean, big deal. You know what I mean? Mm, yes, hello. What do you wear to bed? A uh, racy question. Imaginary bowl of questions. Uh, it depends. I usually wear my dog. Root beer. Uh, and a full leather sweatsuit. In case you thought that was a racy answer, no, I am fully covered at all times. A total neck, footsies, gloves, all leather, and root beer. Have you ever seen something you can't explain? If so, what? Oh, the things I've seen. You don't even want to know these horrors I've seen. Have you ever seen a Fellini film? If you got trapped with no reception and only had five songs on your phone, what would you hope they were? Ooh, baby, I like it raw. Shake it like a salt shaker. To the window, to the wall. I like it when you call me Big Papa, and so forth. What's a relationship deal breaker for you? No pants, put your pants on. No, but seriously, if somebody walks around with no pant underpants and a t-shirt, I'm like, I don't want to fucking see your privates in this context. Do me a favor. Uh, let's just call it a, a wrap. Uh, when I met you, you were wearing bottoms. And if you're going to take off your bottoms, you also have to take off your top. My advice to young men is, um, what is a man, you know? Uh, 